every woman that you meet has a story to tell. What does New York do for you? There is a palpable energy in this city that's incredible. It is so diverse. It is so filled with possibilities and anything can happen. You couldn't or could you do what you do in any other place? You know, the aperture through which I see the world is informed by the places I've lived and been. The privilege of having been in so many countries and living in so many places has changed the way I see and understand the way people look. How has your idea of what style is, what it can do for the spirit, changed since you started making clothes? I started making clothes because I couldn't find anything that fit my changing body, quite frankly. I mean, my closest relationship right now is with gravity. And I couldn't find anything out there that was fitting my changing lifestyle and my changing body. And I felt like what was out there kind of read, I give up. And honey, I will give up when I'm ice cold on a slab. There just wasn't anything out there. So what changed was me and starting to design things for myself and my contemporaries because I had a hunch maybe other people had some of the same issues. When you have two different collections, is it like having two kids? It's exactly like kids. having two kids. <laughs> I love them both. I try and treat them equally, but on some days I just like one better than the other. <laughs> Your accessories have really come a long way. It looks like you just keep building. When I was working uh, in Canada with my Canadian manufacturer, I said, I think that we should do like a belt necklace. And our mutual friend said to me, Marla, you're a clothing designer. And I said, look, I'll make you a deal. If no one stops me between now and the restaurant and says, where'd you get the necklace? I'll shut up for hmm, six to 12 months. <laughs> if someone does stop me, we have to make this and you're buying lunch. We made jewelry and I had lobster. My customer is everything. I don't try to be for everyone, I'm not. But I really want to serve her. 